Allez, troisième journée de cette e-league, nous sommes avec Pronax de l'équipe Godsend qui vient tout juste de se qualifier pour le Major. Hey Pronax, how do you feel to, uh, today after that third win? Uh, right now I feel pretty amazing actually. So, yeah. Now let's talk about what happened in August when you swapped three players with Fnatic. Um, what was the reasoning behind it, this change? I mean, basically we had the chance to get three of the best players in the world on our team and a major spot. So business-wise and for the team, it, it just made sense. Well, like when we had options, why wouldn't we go for it? That's how it felt. But the team didn't work out that great. We have struggled a lot. And even with the new lineup, even though it felt a lot better when Lecro came into the lineup, the chemistry was better. We have had a, have a, we have had a lot of tough weeks for sure. But, uh, we had a big team talk before this, uh, before this tournament, uh, actually like the day before where we just talked out and decided like, okay, we, we are going to make this, this major basically. Yeah. As you said, you, you, in, since the beginning of this lineup, you had uh, some pretty tough events. Uh, what do you, what do you, uh, how do you explain these, these, uh, struggles? I don't know. Like, I think Flasha put it pretty good in on other interview where he said that there has been a lot of insecurities in the team and it definitely has been. We have argued a lot and we have had like a lot of discussions about how we should play, but we, we have never really came to a conclusion really. And I don't know. Everything just clicked when we had this team meeting, when we talked face to face, everyone. And I don't, I, I don't really know. We, we just had a very good feeling after that. And we were confident. We didn't argue during the game. We, even if we made silly mistakes, we just like, okay, f it doesn't matter. Just focus on the next round. And I think, yeah, I think that's why we managed to win. Yeah, no, let's talk about the major qualifier. You went here by uh, finishing at the second place on the Euro European minor. You faced G2 in the opener. Uh, it went pretty well for you. Actually, we won the minor, but uh, yeah, oh, sorry. <laughs> it's uh, fine. But uh, yeah, I, I don't, yeah, it, it, just, it just went well, I guess. We, we played great. Everyone had their rounds and the, the team spirit was really good, so. And then you played uh, Dignitas on their home map, Mirage. You were kind of the outsider, if I can say so. Um, and what can you say about this match? Did you know how to, how to counter strike uh, this team? I mean, we knew that they like to play aggressive on A. Uh, so we actually, when we're, we're down like 7 to 1 or something, we, 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 kind of knew how they would play, but they just hit their shots and we made some silly mistakes as well. But we showed resilience. Like, that's what I talked about before. We didn't start started to argue about the mistakes and we just said, like, it's okay. It's, we just need four rounds. We just need to, like, just think, just try to get the next round, basically. That, that's the mentality we had. And you had, you had a pretty good start against El Razor as well. We winning some pretty good rounds on T side and train. And then uh, city, city side went very well for you, yeah. meaning you are now qualified for the major in January. What is the plan until the end of the year for you? Uh, now, when we get home, we are actually going to have a break. I think Lecre is going away with his family, so he's going to be home like one day before, actually the same day that we have the DreamHack Masters qualifier. And uh, the day after that, we're going to China to play a tournament, WESG. Yeah, exactly. And after that, I think we have two or three days to practice before the major. So we, we don't, won't have that much practice, but uh, we, I think we will play a lot of uh, individually and uh, watch demos and just like try to come up with stuff anyway. And yeah, we're, we're going to do everything we can despite not having that many days to practice. Well, congrats on getting this spot. I will let you say the final words if you want. Yeah, I would uh, just like to thank every fans uh, that have supported us, even though we have had some rough times. So thank you to them. Well, thank you. Allez, à bientôt sur Vacam.net pour d'autres interviews.